Oh, YouTube's not there yet. All right, we are live. Yay, we are live. We are live. We are live. Hello, everyone, and welcome to Mommy Boutique. Tonight is a very special night because it is raffle night. We're going to be raffling off this little beauty called the Cutie Crab Ring. Let me show you guys up close what this looks like for those of you who are just joining and never seen it. Isn't it adorable? So this is actually custom made by me. Well, not technically, but I designed it and had a jeweler make it. Um, so this is a one of a kind ring from Mommy Boutique. Now you may find something similar out there, but it's not going to be exactly like this because I designed it. So um, this is a Mommy Boutique exclusive item that we'll be raffling off tonight. And so if you guys have never been here before, first of all, welcome. I'm Seashell Sheena. And if you don't see that live button up at the top of your screen right there, that means you are watching a replay. So go ahead and hashtag replay so I know that you were here. And if this is also, if it's your first time watching, go to the Facebook page, which is facebook.com slash mommy boutique and um, send me a message to let me know that you were here. And also if you have any questions, I will answer you there. Um, I'm sorry, it's mommy boutiques with at the end. There is a mommy boutique, but it's not me. So mommy boutiques with an S at the end is me. Um, and here on YouTube, it's youtube.com slash mommy boutique. I know that's confusing, but boutique was taken on Facebook, wasn't on YouTube. So I had to make it work. I have something up here that's bothering me. There's like a clip up here at the top. It's like, okay. So anyway, guys, um, we are doing raffle night. And what we do here at mommy boutique is we um, open up oysters for you. And they look something like this with real pearls inside. And you never know the, the shape, color, the shape, color, or size. But we do know that they're all going to be beautiful, of course. Here's an example of some of what you could get in our beautiful oysters. There's something black on that pearl right there. Let me get that off. What is that? Oh, it's like a piece of sand. Okie dokie. There you go. So this is what the pearls could look like. Now we also have freshwater pearls that you can get. So for instance, if you win a game or something and it says freshwater pearls, I'll show you what those look like. Freshwater pearls are a little bit bigger and not as round. There we go. So thankfully, I was only a few minutes late, guys. Thank you for bearing with me um, about five minutes late that I was. So thank you so much for being here, guys. Uh, I apologize that I was late tonight. I will tell you why. I had a pretty good explanation, I feel. <laughs> so I don't feel too bad about it. I was I was literally um, on a call until I got over. All right. So let me share this um, on the Facebook page. And guys, when you pop in, let me know that you're here. Say hello, especially if you're on Facebook, because Facebook does not let me know who you are until you start talking. So hi, Sandy. Welcome. I'm going to share this over on the Facebook page. I'll be right back. Mm -hmm. Okay, so let me share this. Ooh, you guys. Oops. Okay, okay, Facebook. That is not what I wanted to do. Okay, leave for now. Oh, it's trying to make me do a watch party. I just want to share it in a group. I was wondering what was going on here. I don't really know what the watch parties are and like I've seen them before, but I don't know how to do it on my end. Cause when I've tried to do watch parties on my end, I never get the comments or anything. Like I can never see them. So I don't know how they work exactly. How are you doing tonight, Sandy? Oh, well, it usually takes about three days. So if it's not there yet, then it should be coming in the next couple of days, I'm imagining. Hi, Taylor. Mm -hmm. 
Hello, 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 hello. Um, I can always check on tracking too. If you remind me, I'll check it out. Uh oh, is this leaking? I had my lipstick on here. Um, let me know. You know what? If it doesn't get there in the next couple of days, Sandy, like if you don't get it, well, tomorrow it could come, but it's not going to come Sunday. So if it doesn't come by Monday or Tuesday, let me know and I'll check on the tracking for you. Um, so guys, let me tell you what I've been doing. Woo. I am exhausted. First of all. So like, and not exhausted because I've been like running around or anything exhausted, but just mentally exhausted because I have soaked up so much information. I can't even talk. That's how exhausted I am. So I'm going to formally apologize now because I'm probably not going to be um, firing on all levels. Um, so as you guys know, I am a life coach. Yay. I am a, now I'm a certified life coach, right? So before I was getting my certification, now I've actually gotten my certification. I graduated so flipping excited, but with the coaching Academy that I am in, of course, they give a lot of support after you graduate, which I think is amazing. And it just so happens that it came at the perfect timing because right now with coronavirus, we really need all the support we can get when launching a business, right? So um, they are holding this three-day conference um, and it was going to be like a live in-person thing, which I'm kind of glad that it ended up being online because I wouldn't be able to go because um, I think it was going to be like in Texas or something. But anyway, now it's on Zoom. So it's really awesome. And now I get to go because I can be on Zoom. But it's an eight hour. I think it's from it's from one to eight. So yeah, that's like eight hours, right? So one to eight, um, I've been sitting in front of the computer soaking up information about my coaching business. Now, of course, we've gotten breaks and I got like a good 20 minute break before I popped on here so that I could eat dinner. Um, but that that brought me behind. So I'm apologizing because it kind of went long uh, and my brain is like, Woo, I'm like, I don't know if I can soak up any more information. <laughs> My brain. Well, it's a three day, a three day event. So I will be um, doing the same thing tomorrow and on Sunday. But I'm just really grateful that the school is doing this for us because I feel like, you know, it's really needed, especially right now, because we get, you know, people get discouraged. The businesses are losing money and everything. So um, it's a lot of great knowledge, you know, and of course, afterwards, they're going to want you to, you know, buy into their program or whatever else that they're selling. But I'm just there for the knowledge. Um, and I think it's really great. And I've gotten a lot of stuff so far. So please forgive me if I'm not firing at 100%. If I feel if I seem kind of off at all, um, I'm not meaning to and if I if I neglect anybody or make any feel uncomfortable or not pay attention to you, just know it's not on purpose. My brain is literally at like, 45% capacity. <laughs> like my batteries are like 45%, maybe 35 right now. So I'm, I'm going to go as much as I can. And I do apologize ahead of time. Uh, just in case I mess up on anybody's names, or if I'm fumbling for my words, just know it's because I've literally been soaking up information for eight hours. So there's my disclaimer for tonight. <laughs> there you go. Now, and the good news, tonight is raffle night, and we will be raffling off this little beauty, which is the Cutie Crab Ring, customized by me. This is a one-of-kind exclusive ring from Mommy Boutique. Like I said, you may find something that looks similar, but it's not going to be exactly the same because I designed this. This is my design. And inside of the band, it will say Mommy Boutique engraved in there. Um, which is really awesome. This is 925 sterling silver. This is real and it's got um, crystals in there. Um, and of course your real pearl. So somebody's going to win this tonight. Let me tell you how um, anybody who has ordered in the month of May and you've spent $25 on the website, if you've spent $25, sorry, my camera's on there. If you've spent $25 on the website, you get a ticket. So for every $25 that you spend, you get a ticket. If you spend $50, you get two tickets. And the more you order, the more tickets you get. So if you order one night and you spend 25 and the next night you spend 35 and the next night you spend 45, it all adds it together. And so you'll get a ticket for every single time. Okay. So that's how it works. And as you can see here, I got my tickets already. And um, Sandy, I got your order. Thank you. I got your tickets in there. So we got two for Jessica tonight. We got one, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five, six for Sandy. You're in there six times. Two, no, three for Trisha and three for Daniel. 
So um, got a good chance of winning tonight, guys. So if you want to get your orders in, now is the time. We are not doing a flash sale special, but we are still doing the um, elder special, which is $18 for those. And, um, you know, the games are all changing and we're going to get to see one today because Sandy got a game. I'm so excited. Woohoo, Sandy. Um, and she's going to be doing our newest game, which is the mystery bag game where she gets to pick out a bag and there is mystery items in there. So I'm really super stoked about that. So thank you for that order, Sandy. So do you guys have any questions or whatever you want to talk a little bit before we get to shucking it? I'd love to hear from you. Where's Paige and Trish tonight? They're not on. Oh, man. I am so mentally exhausted, you guys. You don't even know. Whew. <laughs> I'm like sitting here like, oh, my God, Sheena, my brain, my brain. So much information. Good information, though. It was good. I had a new candy bar tonight, which I thought was really yummy. It's called Cho Choco Love Almonds and Sea Salt and Dark Chocolate. I don't know if anybody's had this before, but they actually sent it to me in the mail uh, for this summit or this whatever this is called that we're on the three-day summit. Everybody got a package in the mail. Um, kind of looked like this. Bum -ba -da! And it had like all kinds of snacks and goodies in it. That was so exciting. And that was one of them. And I ate that today. It was so good. Dark chocolate. I'm, I'm gonna have to get some, some more of those. And they also gave me and uh, of course, I'm trying to like not engorge on all this stuff because I have three days of it. But they also gave me cookies. What? That's right. Cookies. And um, so I'm totally excited. And I got a peanut butter bar peanut butter cookie in there. Oh my gosh. So many goodies for this summit that I'm doing. So keeping me with substance while I'm sitting there for eight hours, staring at the screen, listening. <laughs> Hi, Rhonda. Rhonda, it has been forever. How are you, love? It's good to see you. It is raffle night tonight. If you want to get a ticket, get on over to the website, mommyboutique.net guys, mommyboutique.net. And I got my hair did, guys. My, my lighting in here is kind of bad, but I got my hair done. I'm so excited. I need to wash it because it's been it's been two days since I got it done. So my hair, if I don't wash it every two days, it starts to look kind of greasy. I don't know why. It just does. But anyway, I got my hair done. So looking good, right? I'm so excited about this new style. It's like the Rachel style. It looks very prof professional, though. Got a new shirt. Look at this. I'm flowing. Woohoo! <laughs> And of course, I'm wearing some of my pearl jewelry. Let's check it out. This is the sunflower. You can get this over um, at shop and then boutique line. This is actually a yellow freshwater pearl. So you can see kind of it's bigger than the regular. It's a freshwater pearl instead of the saltwater pearl. So that is something that we offer over there on the boutique line. And just to give you guys a reference, the boutique line is all the items that are drilled, meaning it does not have a pearl already in it. And you can customize it with your pearl. The jewelry, if you click on shop and then jewelry, those are already preset. Um, I can show you what those look like. Let me reach over here in my bucket without falling. Ugh. Okay. So the preset jewelry or just the jewelry looks like this. So this is one of the spiral pearls, but this is one of them you guys can get. They already have pearls on them. That's what those are. Oh, this one's really cute. This I think this is the eternity one. I really like this one. It's so pretty. Isn't that pretty? So th these are all preset jewelry items. Hi, Rhonda. I'm so glad to see you. Also in here, we do have some fake pearls. So if you guys love fake pearls and you're wanting fake pearls, let me know. I do have um, these. Most of them are about $20 to $25 for those. But you can have um, a nice set. This is $25. You get your earrings, you get your bracelet, and your necklace. It is fake pearls, but it's still beautiful. And um, for those of you who have always wanted pearls but just don't want to spend the money on the, the real ones, there you go. Okay, so that is what the preset jewelries look like. Thank you. I'm so glad you like it. 
Yeah, I told my beautician, I was like, I want something professional. Of course, like I said, it's kind of, I haven't done much with it today because I was literally sitting, I'm, I was sitting right here for, for the past eight hours. So I'm like, <laughs> so exhausted. Oh, I forgot to refill my water. I literally, so the call went a little bit over. It got done at like 845, just to let you guys know. And so at 845, I got off the call. I ran to the kitchen. I scarfed down dinner so I would have something to eat. Then I ran back here to get all your raffle tickets because I had to get ready for the party for, you know, tonight's raffle and print out the orders. So I was literally scrambling. That's why I was like, I don't know if I'm going to make it in time. But I was only five minutes late, so it wasn't too bad. <laughs> Yeah, Rhonda, the only oysters we have right now are the elders. So if you look under oysters and it says elder oysters, they're the ones that are $18. They're the older oysters. That's all we have left. Can you believe it? That's all we have left. We sold out of all the other oysters. And because of the coronavirus, I am not able to purchase anymore. But the elder oysters, just to give you a disclaimer of what they are, they're just oysters that have been around a long time. And, um, sometimes the pearls inside might be a little discolored, but for the most part, most of the time they're pretty perfect. If the pearl is seriously like jacked up, of course, I will let you trade it for one. That's not, uh, wash them off with some salt water and a soft brush toothbrush. Um, most of the time it's like skin that's on it. So it comes right off. But Rhonda, so if you go back to the website and you look for elder, E-L-D-E-R, elder. So like just old <laughs> elder oysters. We do have some of those available, but yes, everything is getting sold out, which is exciting. I think, right. I think it's exciting for you guys. You guys are like, what? There's nothing there. But for me, it's exciting because that means I can get a whole new inventory here soon. So yeah, I'm really excited. Oh, thank you, Rhonda. It's been forever since you've been on my lives. I'm glad to see you here. Woo. All right. So tell me, Sandy, how have you been? Taylor, how have you been? Mm -hmm. What a beautiful night. And they call it Valentine. There is a, a lag on my... There is a lag on my stream, guys. Sorry about that. I just, I, I just noticed that. When you guys pop on, make sure you say hi so I know who you are. Facebook doesn't like to tell me who you are until you start chatting. And the same with YouTube. I can see the numbers, but I won't know who you are until you start chatting. Yeah, I was really excited when my beautician posted on Facebook that they were opening again. Of course, there are rules in place. I did have to have um, a mask on the whole time. And there's only allowed to be two people inside of the salon at the, at the same time. And they have to be obviously on opposite sides of the room with one beautician on this side and one beautician on that side. Um, you know, and then we have to put hand sanitizer on like when we first walk in and then also when we walk out. So, um, you know, there's, it's, it's good though. There, it's good that they're doing that practice and making sure everybody is healthy and stuff. Um, we are actually, we have passes to go to Legoland and we've had passes, but, um, they expired because we weren't able to go. I think they expired. Actually, I think they expired this month. Um, so I called Legoland today cause they're opening up back in June and um, we were going to go for Kira, uh, for Sasha's birthday, which is in May, but we couldn't go. And then my birthday is in June. My birthday is June 8th. And um, my son's birthday is in July. So we figured that maybe we can go in June and July and, um, you know, for the passes. So I called them and they are going to honor um, for us for two more months. So, um, no, maybe three more months because they said it didn't, it won't expire until September. So what is this, May? Well, pretty much June, right? June. July, August. Yeah. So three months, they're giving us three months. So woohoo! So I'm excited about that. Um, there is a lot more rules now. They actually check your temperature when you first get to the park, they said. So like when you first walk in and I'm guessing it's going to be the same thing across the board with Disney and um, Universal and SeaWorld and all of those theme parks. Remember, I live in the, uh, the theme park capital of the world over here. So that's what we do. Um, <laughs> 
So anyway, they said that there is, you have to check your temperature when you first walk in. You don't have to wear a mask unless you want to, but for all of the rides and all of the lines, you do have to stay six feet apart and there are going to be little, you know, places for you to stand. There is uh, people, they hired, I guess, a whole bunch of new staff members for sanitizers. So they're going to go behind everybody and just wipe everything down on the rides and everything. So um, you know, they're doing, they're doing a good thing to kind of keep everybody safe, which is good. You know, um, I'm, I'm kind of ready to get back to normal life, but I know that the coronavirus is still very much real and out there. Um, so I'm apprehensive to go because I'm like, on one hand, I'm like, I really want to get out of the house. I mean, it's been, my gosh, it's been like seven weeks longer than that. Like nine weeks. It's been like nine weeks. Right. So I'm totally ready. And I love going out to Legoland. It's one of my favorite parks because I don't like to ride rides. Like I'm not a ride person, but I will ride almost every single ride at Legoland, except for like the, the big roller coasters, but everything else I ride at Legoland because Legoland is literally a park for 12 and under. So like, it's not really a park for adults. Um, if you're going to go there, like with a group of friends just to hang out, you're going to be so bored. But if you're there with kids that are 12 and under, you're going to have a blast because that's what we do. Um, but anyway, so I go on every single ride at Legoland. So for me, it's like the only park that I really, really, really enjoy. Otherwise at Disney, I'm just, I just spend the whole time watching shows or going into the gift shops because I don't ride the rides and everybody else, you know, the kids and want to go on the rides. And I'm like, mm -mm, I don't ride them. <laughs> so anyway, I'm kind of excited on one hand. On the other hand, I'm like, I don't know. Do I really want to? you know, expose myself to that because, you know, there's probably going to be a lot of people around the world there. But I mean, if, if they're taking temperatures and stuff, I feel like, I feel like we'll be safe. You know, what do you, what are you guys' thoughts on theme parks right now? I don't want to stir up any negative feelings. I just want to know <clears throat> what are your thoughts on theme parks? Oh, you guys can see that my crystal drawer. You guys see my crystal drawer? It's my crystal drawer. Look, my crystals. I went and only ones in stock is 32. And they said, what? Hold on, Rhonda. Let me check. Rhonda, let me check, darling, because I should still have it unless I forgot to update the inventory, which is possible. So let me check one second. Hold the phone. Hold on. I apologize. I didn't get a notification that I was out though. Oh, yep. You're right. You are right. It says I'm out. So I'm not because I still have, let me see how many I have. So we got two for Sandy tonight. I'm just going to put those over there for now. I have one, two, three, four, five, six. Seven, eight. I'm just gonna stick them all in one bed. Okay, so that was eight. Just trying to see how many I have. Eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen. Okay, so I have eighteen. So let me update that really quickly. Hold on. Thank you for telling me, Rhonda. I did not realize that. I'm going to update it. I have 18 left. Sorry, darling. Sorry. No, I'm glad you told me, Rhonda, because otherwise I wouldn't have known. So I'm glad you told me. It's weird, too, because my, my website usually will, like, notify me on messenger to say or not messenger but on my email to say you were out of stock of whatever but it didn't so that's weird that's weird sure hold on i'm so sorry let me get it back up there so we can get this pot of started all right let me go to inventory Doo -doo -doo. okay what did i say 18 i said 18 right i think i said 18 well, I'm going to put 18. So hopefully that's right. Hold on. It'll just take me a second. Got to get to the right place. Hmm. 
Hmm, that is so weird that it says it's out of stock. Okay, 18. Let me get down here. <laughs> All right, so let's fix this. 18 is in stock. Okay, update. All right, so it's updated now, so you should be able to see it. I just updated it, but let me go back and see what you were talking about with the $32 one, because that one, the Elder um, Oyster, the Elder Edison should be out of stock. So maybe that's the one that I messed up on before. So give me just a second. Give me just a second, y'all. I need an admin to do all this for me, right? I need, I need a tech person so I can do the party and they can do the tech stuff. That would be ideal. Those bigger companies, they have someone that runs the tech. I'll get my team on it. <laughs> I am the team. I do everything. I wear all the hats. I'm the shipping. <laughs> I'm the maintenance department. I do it all. Oh, yeah. Look at that. Okay. So that's where I went wrong. I put the Elder Edison was 10 in stock when actually we don't have any more Elder Edison. That should have been out. Yeah, so that's what I did. That's what I did wrong. All right. So the one that's out of stock, Rhonda, is the um, the Edison one. I must have messed that up when I did the inventory. So I apologize because, yes, we have run out of that one. Dude. All messed up. Woo! Well, I told you my brain was a mess today. All right, Rhonda, it's fixed. Thank you so much for telling me that. And if you order um, tonight, Rhonda, you will get put in your in the raffle to win this beautiful cutie crab ring uh, as long as you spend $25 or more. All right, so that should have fixed that. Now I'm back, sorry. Oh, thank you, Sandy. Sandy, um, oh, I see your comments now. Yeah, you think it's okay? Yeah, I'm not sure. I have mixed feelings about it, Sandy, because I'm like, you know, on one hand, I'm like, I'm really tired of being cooped up. But on the other hand, it's like, well, do I really want to expose me and my family and my kids to a virus? But, you know, I, I also feel like I don't want to live in fear. I mean, that's, that's kind of what it comes down to, too. I don't want to live in fear. I don't want to, you know, have that feeling. Because the way that I believe and, and knowing what I know about the law of attraction and how it works is um, you get what you think about. So if I live in fear, fearing that I'm going to get the coronavirus, then I will most likely get the coronavirus. So thank you, Rhonda. I appreciate that. I really do. So that's the other thing is like, I don't really want to sit at home fearing that something bad is going to happen. Instead, I'd rather, you know, enjoy life and just protect myself, you know, with God's love and light and have fun. Enjoy it. Cause man, I'm telling you, but yeah, since we, we only have three months to enjoy it before our passes run out. And I don't know if we're going to renew them, uh, especially what's, what, what's going on right now in the world. I don't know if it's worth it to renew them. So, um, yeah, I think that we'll just enjoy the last three months of our pass and soak it up as much as we can. And then probably, you know, do more things that are home-based or maybe, you know, arcades or something. I don't know even if arcades are open. <gasps> Paige. Yes, we have two orders, darling. I was just, um, I was just chit-chatting actually. There's really no reason for me to be chit-chatting. I'm just chit-chatting, you know, waiting for everybody to pop on. Hey, where were you girl? I didn't see you. Where's Miss Trish tonight? Do, do, do. You missed it, Paige. I was saying that I, I'm giving a disclaimer to everybody right now because I, for the last eight hours, have been sitting right here in a summit or a conference or I don't know what you call it, but um, an event, a webinar. I don't know. But anyway, <laughs> it was a um, eight hour coaching um, 
summit where uh, my, my class, you guys know I'm a certified life coach now. Um, anyway, my class offered this to everyone, especially during this time to help us launch our businesses um, and, you know, get more clients and things like that. So it's a three day summit. So it's going to be today, tomorrow and the next day. But um, it was supposed to end at 8 p.m. It actually did not end until 845. So I literally got off the call, ran and ate dinner because I was starving by that point. I did have snacks. I was showing you guys I had snacks, but like I wanted food, food. And um, so I ran to eat dinner and then I had to get ready for the call. So or for the for the party. So if I'm a little bit flustered, I do apologize. And if I call anybody by the wrong name, please know it's not intentional. I'm not trying to neglect anybody whatsoever. My brain is just literally like right now. I like, I don't know if I can fit any more information into my brain. My brain is just like, Oh, overload. Oh, awesome. Paige. That's great. What show are you guys watching? I'm always looking for good shows. If you guys know, I'm really bad because I started watching the vampire diaries, like, like six months ago. And I literally been, well, maybe a little bit more than that. Probably last year I started watching it. There's Trish. Hi. So I started like watching the vampire diaries and literally binge watched it, finished it in like three months, which is crazy because there's many episodes. And then I promised myself because I got so addicted to it that I was like, I would let it take over. Right. I was like every waking moment that I had some little bits of time, I would be watching that movie or that show. So then I said, well, I'm not going to watch the rest of them for a while because there's like three others. I think there's like legacies and originals, two others. And I was like, well, I'm not going to watch them for a while because I want to, you know, kind of wean off the addiction of the vampire diaries. Well, now I started watching the originals just like last month and I'm already on season five. Oh my God. It's like when I find a show that I really like, and I'm really bad too, because I don't have an hour like a lot of times I don't have a full hour to just sit and watch Netflix. So what I'll do is when I have like a 15 or 20 minute break between calls or whatever, I'll sit and watch 15 or 20 minutes of the show. I'll stop it and then I'll come back to it. So sometimes it takes me like three days to watch one episode, but I still like, I'm so addicted. Um, <laughs> so I'm watching the originals right now. Hello, Manoop. How are you? Where are you from? Manoop, Manoop, Manoop. Trish, it's lovely to see you tonight. How are ya? All right, Sandy. So I was kind of letting everybody pop on before we started with your order. So um, whenever you're ready, we can get started. You will be doing the mystery bag tonight. So exciting. You'll be the first one that gets to do the mystery bag. The mystery bag. You're a bit tired. Me too. Did you hear my story, Trish? I have literally been sitting in front of this computer forever. It's been so long since I've been on here. Hi, Victoria. It has. Where have you been? We've missed you. No, you're not first in my live, darling. You're like, I don't know, number 10 maybe. Yeah, I feel you on the tired part, Trish. I don't know if you heard me, but um, my my school where I just graduated to be a life coach, um, they are hosting a, a week weekend summit. Well, Friday, Saturday, Sunday at eight hours. It's for, well, it's from one to eight from Friday, Saturday, Sunday. But tonight they actually went until 845. So I didn't get off of the call until 845. And then I ran to eat and got, got ready for you guys. So I'm a little bit out of it. Um, and like I was saying, if I call anybody by the wrong name or... Um, you know, say something stupid or doesn't make sense, please know that I'm not, it's not intentional. It's just my brain is not fully there because of all the information that I soaked up tonight. So I'm just making that wide disclaimer so that everyone knows that I definitely don't want anyone to feel like I'm not paying attention to them. It's just my brain is literally like going on fumes right now. So, so much information. It was good information and I'm glad I, you know, I'm going because already I feel like I've gotten uh, a lot of information to help me launch my, my coaching business. So excited about that, but boy, I'm like mentally, mentally exhausted, not physically. It's not like I exercise for, you know, eight hours, but like mentally exhausted just from all that information. Yeah. I get broken sleep too. 
Uh, Paige, actually, I think it's just Trish because when I did it, when I looked, your name wasn't on there because I think Trish ordered for you, right? Am I right? Because the way I do it, Paige, just so you know, is I just go by the orders. So if, if Trish paid for you, then it goes into Trish's name unless you want me to put it in yours, which I can do. Oh, yeah. So, Victoria, what do you do? Yeah, it works well. My, my son, you guys, I don't know if you saw. Oh, I don't even know if I posted it. Yeah, I think I did. I think I posted it on Facebook. But, you guys, my son just graduated from pre-K today, like officially. Um, about two weeks ago, he went in for his graduation pictures. But today he actually graduated. It was a it was a drive through graduation, which was quite interesting. They the teachers were holding up like flyers of the kids faces. And then you get out of the car and you get to hug the teacher. He, they, he did. And then you take a picture of them handing him his little, you know, cute little pre-K diploma. And then we get back in our car. <laughs> But it was really cute. And oh my God, you guys, Dominic cried. Like he missed his teacher so bad. When we got home, he was in tears, bawling. He wanted to go back to school. And I feel so bad because next year he's going to a completely different school because the school that he's in is just pre-K. So he'll be completely switching schools. So I feel so bad. He'll never see him. Oh my God. It was so, so sweet. All right, Miss Sandy. Hello, hello. Are you ready to get started? So the first thing is our mystery bag. So let me explain to you guys how this works because this is new. Now I know this looks your behavior technician. Oh, that's interesting, Victoria. That's really interesting. My son goes to OT. Um, he has he has speech and OT five days a week. Actually, my son. So. He's um, maybe you can help me with potty training because he does not want to potty train, Victoria. Um, you can put one in her name. Sure. I sure will, Trish. I definitely will switch that up. Okay. You actually have three, I think, Trish. Let me see. Because I add all the orders together, yours and her. Well, I, were, I added them all. So you end up with three. But one of those will be pages. So that will still leave you with two. So let me just mark out one of those and put it in Paige's name. All right. Got it. You got it, dude. What's scary? What's scary, Sandy? I, I missed it. Is it scary? Oh, the mystery box. No. All right. So this is what it is, guys. So I know you guys have all seen this with the boutique bag, right? So the difference is now there are prizes. <laughs> Nothing scary, I promise. There are prizes inside of the bags. So just like the boutique bag where you guys had the cards and it would give you prizes. Well, now the prizes are actually inside of the bags and whatever is inside of the bags you get to keep. Okay. So that's how it works. Um, so it's similar to what we were doing before, but we switched it up. So that now you actually have real prizes inside of the bags. Okay. So it's going to be fun. It's a mystery bag. All right. Miss Sandy. This is going to be number one. And what you're going to do is you're going to choose a bag that you want. Okay. Whatever bag you choose is the one you keep. So one, two, three, four, five, and six. So six is the one that's leaning over here at the bottom. And one is the one that's standing up. So six over here, six, five, four, three, two, one, one, two, three, four, five, six. So pick a number and I'll reveal your prize.
And I know there's a lag on the comments, so just give her a minute. If um, Trish or Paige, if you see her comment before I do, let me know. But just, again, over here starts number one. So just put, put in whatever number or type in the words if you need to. One, two, three, four, five, and six. Or six, five, four, three, two, and one. Yes, these two are two separate right here. So this is a new game, guys. You guys are seeing it for the first time. Exclusive right here. First time seeing this game. It is called the mystery game. Again, we are just redoing the boutique bag game. So we're using the same games and the same method, but there are prizes inside of it instead of it being cards. Sandy D, where'd you go? Sandra. Oh, my little Sandra. Okay, is the comments just not working, guys? Um, Paige and Trish, can you guys message? Can you write something in the comment box to make sure that it's working? Because I'm not seeing any comments. So let me see if I can refresh it. Okay, I'm not seeing anything other than Sandy said, is it scary? Oh, okay, so I see it now. All right, Sandy, you're there. All right, go ahead and tell me a number, darling. Sorry, I didn't see you before. So pick a number from one to six and let me know uh, what number you want, darling. So I'm just waiting on you, Sandy. One to six. Thank you. I'm so glad it's working. I got worried. I was like, where is everybody? All right, so again, starting over here is number one. Hi, Shannon. Number two, number three, number four, number five, and number six. So we're, we're introducing a new game right now, guys. This is called the mystery bag game. Inside our prizes, you never know what you're going to get. Hello again, Rhonda. And just if you guys are wondering who I'm talking to, I am live on YouTube as well. It's youtube.com slash mommy boutique. And I find that YouTube doesn't glitch as bad, although lately it for some reason, it's been freezing. But um, if you guys want to head over to the YouTube, you can do that as well. Make sure you subscribe. It's youtube.com slash mommy boutique. Or you can, you can stay over on the Facebook page, whichever. It doesn't matter. Sandy, are you are you typing any any numbers in there? Can you maybe type out the number that you want? Because I'm not seeing it coming up. <gasps> Maria. Oh, my goodness. You're gracing us with your presence, Miss Maria. It's been forever. Hello, darling. I know you can't see my face right now. We are playing a game. This is called the mystery bag game. We are waiting on Miss Sandy to give us a number. Miss Sandy, give us a number, Miss Sandy. We're waiting. Do you want number one? Maybe I should do like, like emoji talk or something since I'm not seeing it. All right. Here's the deal. If you want number one, put a green emoji, Sandy, since I'm not seeing your comment. If you want number two, make that pink. So number one, green, number two, pink. Oh gosh. I'm going to forget these colors. Green, pink. Number three can be purple. So green, pink, purple. <laughs> I'm going to forget before I, before I'm done because my brain is fried. Trish and Paige, do you guys see her, her comments? Let me know, please. Cause I'm not seeing it. One pink. Yes. Thank you. Well, I'm, I'm trying to get um, Sandy's. I don't think her, her um, comments are going through. It is Sandy's party right now. We are, Party in with Sandy. She has got this beautiful boutique bag game. Well, no, now it's the mystery bag game. One purple. Thank you. <laughs> I'm trying to get Sandy to talk to me, but she is being silent over there. I'll take number three. We got an answer. Thank you, Miss Sandy. All right, number three. Here we go. One, two, three. Ooh, what's gonna be? What's gonna be? 
Ooh, I'm excited. So whatever is inside is your prize. What did you get? What did you get? Oh, you got beautiful earrings. Awesome. Now the earrings will be coming with, oh, here they are, with twin pearls. Now these are freshwater pearls. So you're going to get freshwater pearls. I don't know if you can see them. Hold on. Let me bring it up. Okay. So you got dun, 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 beautiful pink fresh, freshwater pearls. Let me, let me give you a close up. Hold on. Let me show you your beauties. One second. Let me get them all pretty for you. So you got twins, beautiful pink freshwater pearls. Look at those. Aren't they gorgeous? They look like little eggs little easter eggs and look at these these are so cute they're roses can you see them i know they're in the plastic thank you trish yeah there's a lag there's a lag on the on the comments for some reason okay so and here is your beautiful earrings look at that rosy earrings isn't that gorgeous congratulations you got an earring set darling an earring set, which I believe is about $60 value. So that was a pretty good one, I would say. Oh, thank you. I just bought it, actually, Maria. It's a new top. I bought it from my, to match my, my new hair, <laughs> which is kind of a mess right now. Awesome. Okay, so that's your first prize. You got your twins and your beautiful earrings. So congratulations. So guys, um, that is how the boutique ga the mystery bag game works. I know I've been saying boutique bag for two years, so I got to train myself. This is now the mystery bag. Um, and every single week is going to be a new mystery. So it may not be that same thing each time. So if you guys get this one time and then order again, you may not get the same thing again. Um, each bag has something different in it. So, um, and each week it'd be different things. Awesome, Sandy. Okay, cool. Cool. Sandy, there's a lag on the comments, so that's why it's going weird. It's going wonky. All right, so now you get to choose two oysters. Guys, if you go over to mommyboutique.net, thank you. <laughs> Sandy, all of a sudden, all your comments are coming through. Now I'm seeing three, 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 three. <laughs> it took all of that time for it to catch up. That's so bad. All right. I want to use oh, this tray, right? Okay, so let's go ahead and get your oysters in here so you can choose the one you want. Sorry, Sandy. I did not see any of those comments. They're just now coming through. So I guess there's just a lag on the video. I don't know why. Well, I don't know. I need these all to be in one bag. It's kind of confusing going through all the different bags, but like maybe this bag has better ones in it. I don't know. So all that's left on the website, guys, for oysters is the elder oysters. Let me explain to you what the elder oysters are. They're just oysters that are older. That's all it is. They're older oysters. They've been around a little bit longer and we had them on sale for $18 instead of the normal 23 because sometimes there's some discoloration on the pearls because they've been sitting in the oyster so long without the moistness because it's dry in there right now because these are older. So hello, Amanda. Welcome. I'm not sure why your your comments weren't coming through before, but they're they're working just fine now. Um, maybe if you log out of the log out and come back in, but I don't know. It seems to be working now, so we'll let it see see what your answer will be when we choose. So you get to choose two oysters, darling. Um, what oyster would you like? So here's here is our stickers. We have a black butterfly. Ooh, an empty one. So we just say that one's a blank one because that one's lost its sticker. It's lost its sticker. We have a single rose right there. 
Wait, we have two that's lost its sticker? <gasps> oh, that's a butterfly. My bad. So the one I thought was empty is a butterfly. <laughs> so we have a black butterfly and then we have a pink butterfly, but I don't know why the butterfly is on the wrong side. Oh, maybe because I couldn't move it. Okay. If I move it, it's going to rip. So pink butterfly. Sorry about that. And this one is the single rose. This one is the blank one. Then we have a butterfly going to yellow flowers. We have three roses right there. I saw it, darling. I saw three. I'm sorry. There was a lag on the camera. Not the camera, but the chat. All right. And then in the middle, Sandy, in the middle, we have a hummingbird. It looks like a hummingbird and another bird. So two birds in the middle. So which oysters... You get two. Which ones would you like? And you can stay over on Facebook if you think that one works a little bit better. I don't know what's going on with YouTube. YouTube is really lagging. YouTube, I had all my faith in you because you were the one that always worked for me, but now you're letting me down, YouTube. I'm just, I'm just letting you know. You're letting me down, YouTube. Hello, Amanda. Welcome to the Pearl Party to Mommy Boutique. All right, so let me show you again because I know I was uh, kind of everywhere. We have the black butterfly. We have three roses. A butterfly going to yellow flowers. The blank. The single rose. Three wooden crowns. I don't know why I have that one. And then the beautiful pink butterfly, which is up there on the top. And then the one in the middle is two birds. So you let me know which one you want. Hummingbird and black butterfly. See, I saw that one really good. Okay, so maybe Facebook is the way to go tonight. Who knew? Hummingbird and black butterfly. Black butterfly. Where's the black butterfly? There she is. Okay. Okay. All right. I'm excited. So what are you hoping to get tonight as far as colors? Now we are still in the month of May, which means the color is white. So if you get a white pearl, you will win a free prize. That is the color of the month. Uh, before this live is over, we're going to vote on the next color of the month for June because I haven't done it for the Facebook page, which I still can maybe over the weekend. But um, I'll let you guys help me vote, help, help vote on that. So what colors are you hoping to get in your oysters tonight? What colors are you hoping to get in your oysters tonight, Miss Sandy? White and silver. So, guys, put some white and silver emojis up in the chat box, please. White and silver emojis in the chat box. And we're going to put some seashell sheena juice on these. And we tap them for good luck so that whenever you wear them, Miss Sandy, you will bring good luck and happiness to whoever is around you and as well as to you. All right, guys, here we go. Are you ready to shut? Mother shuckers. Sorry, I just like saying that. <laughs> All right, so number one's got some little fuzzies on his butt. Some, like, hairy butt right there. This one um, is just a little, like, barnacle right there. Interesting. Well, let's go with the bigger one first because, you know, size matters, right? Oh, this one does not look old. This one actually kind of looks moist. There's that word. That's good. Some of them that are elders end up not being elders. So <gasps> you got twins again. 
Oh my God. And look, it's two different color twins. One is like a blue and one is like a lighter, like a lighter color. I can't tell. Maybe a white? Is it blue and white? I can't tell right now on the camera. I'll see when I wash it off. But they're they're fraternal twins. They're not identical. They're two different colors. That's awesome. Two different colors. Congratulations. First set of twins out of the oyster. Actually, your second set of twins because you won twins. So, woohoo! That was a good pick, girl. Siamese twins. Wait, isn't Siamese twins the ones that are connected, though? They have to be fraternal. They're identical or fraternal. Fraternal are the ones that are not identical. Siamese twins are the ones that are connected, like, by their stomach or their leg or their arm or something. Am I right? Yeah, Rhonda says. Awesome. Yeah, Rhonda, you've missed out. We've missed you over here at Mommy Boutique. It's been almost a year since you've been hanging out with us. All right. Let's get this baby open. Maria, if you're still there, let me know. You haven't seen my pearl parties before. This is the first for you. Oh, what do we got? What do we got? Oh, is that a purple? <gasps> a beautiful purple. One of my favorite color purples right there. It's like a beautiful ultraviolet. Look at that. I love that color purple. My favorite purple that we have in these oysters. Oh my God. So gorgeous. Very shiny. Okay. And no twins in that one. That's okay. You've already got two sets of twins tonight. What? That's insane. Okay. Get my towel. All right, let's clean them off and measure them up. All right. No whites or silvers, but that's all right. So this one is like a light green, the one that was in the um, twin. It's like a light green and a blue. So that's, well, and this blue is actually more of like an aqua color, to be honest with you. So one is like a lighter green and one is like an aqua. Very pretty colors. Wow. And that purple, I love that purple. I actually have a ring with that. It's called the open heart ring. You guys can get that on the website um, under boutique line. All right, so your beautiful ultraviolet is 637 in size, millimeters. Oh, it just went up, 638. And the reason we size them is just in case you want to put them in jewelry, you'll know what you can put them in. And the first twin, which is the darker one, is a 6.71, so that's a pretty good size. And the lighter color one is a 6.67. Oh, it went down, 6.69. No, it went up. Oh, I wish it would stop moving. We'll call it 6. Point, what is it? <laughs> it keeps moving, 6.7. All right. Now, Sandy, I have to say, these have no discolorations whatsoever. Sometimes with the elders, you will get like where the back was sitting, it might be a little bit like dull looking instead of that beautiful shiny color, it might look more matte, but yours are absolutely stunning and absolutely shiny. And there's no discoloration whatsoever on them. They are 100% perfect. And that's what I was telling you guys with the elders. Um, sometimes they're just as perfect as if you were spending $32, which is our normal price. Um, but you know, you get it at a discounted rate because these are elders. So, um, you are getting a pretty good deal. There is always that possibility or that chance that you might get one that may not be exactly perfect, but for the most part, come on camera. Hold on. I'm trying to, trying to get it to focus for you. I'm so glad you love them. Hold on. I'm going to go ahead and put the filter on so you can see them because for some reason my camera is not uh, getting them. So see this one right here is like a light green. I couldn't tell at first. I thought it was a white, but it's like a very light green. And then there's your aqua. So those are the two twins right there. You got your light green and your aqua. 
So light green and aqua. And then look at that beautiful purple. It is so shiny. You can see the reflection of my camera. Now, I know I've said this before, but I do have some new watches on here. So I'm going to go ahead and repeat it. Um, the way you value a pearl, to, so you know how much they're worth, the shinier the pearl, the more they're worth. So size does matter. However, if you have a really, really large pearl, if you have a really, really large pearl and it's kind of the matte look and not as shiny, but you have a smaller pearl that is super, super shiny, the smaller pearl may actually be worth as much as the bigger one or more. So the size does have a factor in it, but the shine is really what gives the pearl its value because it means it's just a better uh, quality pearl. So when you're looking at a pearl and you can see a reflection in it, um, like some, some of our Edisons that we have, you can look at it and see your reflection. That is a pearl that is worth a pretty penny. Um, I don't know how to appraise them, so I can't tell you how much these would be worth, but that's how I know that that's uh, how they appraise them. If you are going to get them appraised, Sandy, make sure you go to a pearl specialist because um, if you don't, they actually don't know how to... Um, to value pearls because values, uh, pearls value is very, very different from like, um, any type of stone, like diamonds or anything like that. Hello, Jessica. There, we finally got a close up. Look at that purple. Now, can you see how that shine is? That purple is so shiny. Wow, Sandy, that's gorgeous. Oh my gosh, isn't that beautiful, Trish? <gasps> it's really, really pretty. So we're going to take a picture. Take a picture, it lasts longer. <laughs> Congratulations, Sandy. Those are stunning. Wow. And the fact that you got twins and not even they're not even matching in color. That's so rare. That's so cool. I know Trisha and Paige have gotten them like that because they've gotten like every single type of twin you could possibly have. <laughs> there is something going on with my camera, man. I tried to take a picture earlier and the color was all off. So let me see if I can get it to work a little bit better now. I don't know. Maybe it was blurry. Oh, yeah. See, there was something on my screen. The picture that I took earlier of the ring for the raffle went after I, I didn't realize it until after I posted it. I was like, what is the matter with the color in that picture? Oh, girl, wait until you see these up close. You're going to fall in love. All right. Thank you so much, Sandy. I am so excited for you. You got some awesome, awesome pearls. And I've already got your raffle tickets in there for this order as well. Um, Rhonda, I'm going to get over to my, my, uh, my, yeah, my email in just a second. <laughs> so I'm going to put your twins in a separate bag. I like to keep them separate so you'll know which is which. Thank you, Trish. All right. Woohoo! Awesome sauce. Yeah, and if anybody, um, all the orders that were sent out that usually only take about three days, but if you still haven't got it, um, probably I would say by Monday or Tuesday, you should be getting it. Oh, wait, I already have a bag for you. Duh, I already have a bag for you because you got your earrings. All right, thank you again, Miss Sandy, for that order. I love it. Oh, you were a pre-order, Sandy, so you get a free pearl. See, I always forget that. Always. Okay, so you get a free orphan pearl. So um, you get to choose whether you want a fresh water or salt water. The fresh water are these ones. These are the fresh water that look like eggs. Um, the fresh water is what you got in your earrings. Or you can have a salt water, which are the ones that you just opened. So I almost forgot about your orphan. So whenever you do a pre-order, guys, which is an order that's before the party, you do get an orphan pearl, okay? Sorry, I almost forgot. And Melina wasn't here to remind me. Melina's really good about keeping me on track with that kind of stuff. My brain is like literally at 45% because of all the 
information that was soaked into it earlier from that summit. So, um, so Miss Sandy, what color would you like? Now I know it's hard for you to see, so let's number them. So it looks like right now what we have is a lot of pinks, whites. We have a yellow. We have a champagne and like a bronze color. So let me get you a close up and then I'm going to count for you. So we'll start with number one right here. Salt water. Okay. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and nine. So we have nine. Oh man, I, I want to make it like 10. <laughs> I'm like, it needs to be 10. Um, so nine. So one to nine, one being over here. This is number one. So one to nine. Let me know which one you want. Try and get it a close up for you. Hold on. Hard for me to stay still. The one at the very end is a white. And on the other side, it's like a bronzy color. Number one, that's the bronze one. Very, very pretty. Okay. All right, now let me show you this one real quick. Sorry about that. I almost forgot. I'm so bad about forgetting those orphans. I got to do it like in the beginning so I don't forget. All right, so there's a close-up of it. Almost looks gold. Especially up against the gold rim of this, it looks really gold. Maybe it is a gold. You know, I think that might be gold. Look at it. It's sitting up against that gold rim. It looks like it's the same color. Wow, that's gorgeous. Okay, now you are officially done. Sorry about that. Almost forgot about your, your um, orphan. I got it. I got it. All right, now Miss Rhonda will be next. Thank you for bearing with me. Thank you again, Miss Sandy, for that order. I appreciate it. All right. Woo. All right. Now let's go on over to the oldest. Oh, I love that necklace that you ordered, the Love Crab necklace. I should be able to show you some if I can grab them out for you. Now, that one already has a pearl in it, Rhonda, just so you know. Um, I think I have two, maybe three different colors that you can choose from. What am I doing? Grabbing the wrong thing. Thank you, Sandy. Glad you like it. Yeah, see, there's a lag on the comments. I'm so excited, Rhonda. We haven't seen you here in so long. Welcome. I think it's literally been a year since you've been on my live stream. Just so you guys know, Rhonda is my awesome cousin. She is the one um, that does the paparazzi jewelry that I always tell you guys about. Remember, I always talk to you guys about my cousin who does paparazzi jewelry. That is her. All right. So we got the love crab and then we got the elder. And um, she actually was among some of my very first orders when I first started doing Mommy Boutique. So um, this would be great for you, Rhonda, because my inventory, well, I know it's kind of out of stock right now, but I've um, I've upgraded a lot since I first started. So you'll have uh, even better pearls than before. So I'm really excited. Hi, Tim. Maria, are you still there, darling? All righty, so um, you get a free game. So let me show you how this works now. Hold on, I just had to grab my box. I grab my box of stuff.
All right, so you can choose one of three games, Rhonda. Oh, you know what? Let me put your let me put your raffle ticket in because if I don't do that now, I will forget and then I'll feel really bad. So let me do your raffle ticket. Raffle ticket. So you got, okay, so you're going to get one ticket, Rhonda. One ticket for Rhonda. All right, got your ticket. Woohoo! I didn't want to forget that, so I'm sticking that in there now. So that way I don't have to do it later. All right, back to it. So, uh, Rhonda, you get to choose one of the three free games that we have, okay? You can either choose our spin wheel. Now, the way this works is we spin the wheel, and I have my little um, ghetto stopper right here that will stop it because that's the only way I can figure out how to do it. If you hit on a splash, that means you do not win anything. Um, all the rest have prizes on there that you can win. You also could do the seashell game. Now, this game has numbers on the front of them, 1 through 10. And on the back is either a prize or a splash. Again, if you get a splash, you don't win anything. The only time you'll ever get a splash is on the free games. If you ever order a game, you always win a prize. And then the third one you could do is our sea creatures game. Now, this one has colors on the bottom. Each color represents either a prize or a splash. You got it. So which game would you like to play? The seashells, the sea creatures, or the spin wheel? Almost poked my eye out there. Did you see that? <laughs> so spin wheel, sea creatures, or seashells? Sea creatures, she says. Awesome. Okay. Okay, let me get my cards out. All right, here we go. So here's what we got. We have a cute little froggy, a ducky, a sea star, a turtle, a crab, a dolphin, or the, the pink fishy. So let me know which one you want. Again, we have the frog, a duck, sea star, turtle, crab, dolphin, and fishy. And oh, I forgot the octopus. Octopus. <laughs> I almost forgot about the octopus. The frog, she says. Okay. The frog is a pink. Let's see what we get when we get pink. Hold on. Let me get it. All right. Pink is dun, 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 a scallop orphan, which is actually a uh, freshwater orphan. Orphan is what that is. Oh, congratulations. You got an orphan pearl of your choice. Awesome. Awesome. Congratulations, my darling. All right. So for the sake of me forgetting, especially since I'm not, since I'm not firing on all of my cylinders tonight because my brain is fried, we're going to go ahead and do that orphan first because guess what's going to happen if we wait? Probably going to forget about it. So let's go ahead and pick out your saltwater orphan. I'm sorry, not saltwater, freshwater. See, brain's not working. Freshwater orphan. All right, see, we're going to go ahead and do that right this moment. And let me see if I have any more um, to choose from, because right now there's not a lot of variety in there. So in just a moment. Right now I have a lavender, a light pink. It looks like a really, really light green and a golden. All right, let's put a white in there. We always need a white pearl. Let's put, uh, let's see what other colors we got. Oh, is that it? Now we have some champagne. Let's do a champagne in there too. Okay, and then we'll do a champagne. I think that's all the colors. Wow, I am really running low on colors. Pink? Oh, there's a pink. There we go. Now we got a pink in there. Okay. 
So let me show you the colors we got. There's not many, but you know, we'll make it work. Mommy Boutique is running low and I can't reorder anything because of this pandemic going on. So I'm just going to have to bear with what we got until we're out. <laughs> All right. So let it focus for a second. Oh, she already picked one. She picked the light green. Okay. All right. Well, that makes it easy for me then. I don't have to hold it up to the camera. Sweet. Thank you. All right. So let me hold it up now that there's only one a little bit easier. There's your light green. It's literally so light. It's like a touch of green. Yay. Light's green. Okay. Now what's next? We got an elder, an elder oyster that you get to choose from. So Bum, ba, da, ba. All right, so we have the middle, which um, we'll start with the middle because, you know, um, this one is two birdies. This one is a pink butterfly. Oh, let's move this one over. So we have a, um, what is that? A rose. See my brain. It's like all of them hours sitting in front of the camera. The... Y'all. The summit that I had to go to today, the eight hour summit, my brain is fried. <laughs> this is so much information. Uh, butterfly going to the yellow flowers. And three roses. So three roses, butterfly going to yellow flower, the single rose, the pink butterfly, and the middle one, which is the two birdies. Two birdies. Birdie, birdie. So you let me know which one you would like. Do, do, do. Just a reminder, guys, tonight is raffle night. So if you get your orders in before raffle this evening, then you will be able to get into this raffle. The pink butterfly. Awesome. Butterfly in the sky, we can go twice as high. Just take a look, it's in a book, reading rainbow. All right, where's my scissors? There they are. All right, darling, if you get a white pearl, you will get a free prize because that's the color of the month. Just letting you know that. Uh, what color are you hoping to get tonight? Or we can sing, love is like a butterfly. It's soft and gentle as the sky. The multicolor moods of love, light and satin wings. Love makes your heart feel strange inside. It flutters like soft wings and flies. Love is like a butterfly, a rare and gentle thing. I feel it when you're with me. It happens when you kiss me. That rare and gentle feeling that I feel. Oh, of course you want green. I should have known that. Her favorite color is green. All right, guys, I need some green emojis. Oh, I'm going to do this over the trash because this one's a, this one's definitely an old one. When they're really, really old, they get like shards everywhere. Oh, interesting looking, that one. Singing some Dolly Parton for you there. <laughs> yes, Dolly Parton is my favorite singer in the whole world, and I still love her. I've loved her since I was a child, and... You know, she definitely is one of those people that I have to meet before she passes on. But she's getting up there in age. So if I don't meet her soon, I may not get to meet her. So hopefully she will outlive us all. Oh, thank you, Rhonda. <laughs> all right. So we're hoping for a green. Let's put some seashell sheena juice on this bad boy. And then we tap it. I think I missed it. We're going to tap it six times for you. Because I think I forgot to tap it three times. I can't remember. <laughs> I felt like I missed a tap, so we did it. We did it three more times. For good luck, and whenever you wear this, may this pearl bring you good luck and happiness. Here we go, guys. Here we go. This is an elder oyster. So if you're wondering why it looks so discolored, um, the elder oysters are the only thing we have for sale as far as oysters go, because we have sold out of everything. The elder oysters are just older oysters, just meaning they just oh, they've just been sitting a lot longer. Whoa, look at how old that thing is. This one's really old. Some of the other ones are old, but not as old, just depending on how long they've been sitting. This one. 
And the elders are so hard to get open because, you know, they're hard. So I got to cut through that piece of meat right there usually because that's like the muscle that holds the thing shut. And if it's really, really old like this one, a lot of times it's really hard and I can't get through it. So we end up having to crack this thing into pieces. Oh, I got it. <gasps> Woo! What color is that? Oh, we got a pink. We got a pink. It's not a green, but we got a pink. A beautiful pink. Oh, I think that actually might be a champagne now that I'm looking at it. And I do not see any twins in there. Hold on. Let me just put this over here to the trash. There we go. All right. Let's clean this bad boy off and see the size of her. Rhonda, you should download the, um, the app called Smule, S-M-U-L-E. I am addicted to that app and I am constantly singing on that thing. It's an app where you can um, duet other people and they can duet you. It's a singing app. And um, I am constantly there on there all the time. S-M-U-L-E. And my name on there, I think is Sheena Diane, actually. I think most of my social media is Sheena Diane. Um, so if you guys want to find me on Smule, just look up Sheena Diane. So there is just a little bit of discoloration on the back of this, but it doesn't look like it's too bad. Um, it just looks like a little bit of like, actually, I think I just wiped it off. I don't even see it anymore. Okay. It might've just been a piece of skin. All right. Uh, yeah, I think it was just a piece of skin cause I do not see it. Okay. Maybe there's a little bit. Okay. So there's just like a little part of it that just a tiny bit like matte. Matte meaning it's not as shiny in the back, but not bad at all. Once I um, take a toothbrush to it, should be perfect. All right, this is a 6.5. Yeah, I sing on it all the time. I love that app. It's my favorite. I don't really do a lot of um, like Don Johnny loves TikTok and I have a lot of stuff on TikTok, but I don't use it as much. My app is Smule. That's what I do. Like I, especially when I'm stressed out or something, like I will literally sing. That's what I've always done. Rhonda knows I used to sing for her when I was a kid. I was definitely your modern day Dolly Parton. I would sing anytime you asked me to. So we got a champagne and a beautiful light green. It's funny, I used to tell my grandma that I was going to be a country music singer when I grew up. Obviously, that did not work out. <laughs> Mostly because I actually have really bad stage fright, which is funny because I've been singing on stage since I was a little girl, even singing at my high school graduation. But I tell you what, going on stage for me when I got older, not so much when I was a kid, but when I got older, it, it got really hard for me to go on stage and sing. Wow, Rhonda, these are really pretty. Let me get a close-up for you. That's your champagne. Look, he's got a little dimple on top of him. And there's your light green. Good job. Those are really, really pretty. Wow. What do you think? All right, so let me go see if I can find that love crab and see how many I have so you can choose a color really quick. Take off my finger coughs. See how Shelly likes to call them something else. All right, let me see if I can find the love crab real quick. Did I put any in here? I did. All right, so I have one, two. Looks like I have two left, and they are in the colors of champagne. And this one might be a light purple. I think I'm going to have to open them so you can see them. All right, so get my hand behind it so you can actually see it. All right, so there's your light purple.
And this one has, I don't know if you can see it, but it has like red eyes or pink eyes. It's kind of crooked, so I know it's kind of hard to tell, but. Very cute. And then the other one is like a light champagne. I was trying to see if they're different colors. That was the X Factor. You should go on the X Factor. Oh, man. You know, I don't really like competitions, to be honest with you. I'm not good. I'm not good at competitions. I I would rather see someone else win. Like, I know that sounds bad. And it's not that I... It's not that I don't have good self-esteem because I definitely do. But for me, I just, I'm like, I can't be that person that wins over someone else. Like, I just, I don't know. I have a hard time with that. This one is a champagne color. Can you see it? So this one is like a light, really, really light purple. And the other one, oh, I need to put my hand behind it because you can't see it. <laughs> That's okay. I knew what you meant. I knew what you meant, Sandy. Oh, now it's being blurry. Ah. Well, anyway, you saw it earlier, right? So there's a purple or there's a champagne. So you let me know which one you want. This is the love crab, I believe, right? The champagne. That's this one. Okay. Awesome. Yeah. So guys, just so you know, all of the jewelry right now is on sale. Um, so if you go to the jewelry line, you just click on shop and then click on jewelry. Almost, I think almost all of the jewelry, the preset jewelry is all on sale right now. Mostly because we don't have any oysters. So I want you guys to be able to have something fun to do right on mommy boutique. <laughs> Otherwise, what are we going to do with our time if we don't have any oysters to open? We'll have to do games, right? That's the big thing. So thank you so much, Rhonda. Um, you got your love crab. We got our elder opening. We got your freshwater orphan. Okay. And now I got to take a picture for you. Okay. So let's take a quick picture for you for the Facebook page. Do I take requests? You're so funny. Sure. If I know the song. Although, please note, my voice is messed up. I'm tired tonight, so my voice is uh, kind of strained. Like, I've, I've kind of been, like, feeling it in my throat. Because, you know when you're tired and you're, like, trying to stay awake? That's kind of how I'm feeling. So, if you do request a song, I can't guarantee it's going to be my normal <laughs> my normal uh type of singing you're welcome Rhonda thank you so much I'm glad to have you back I've missed you it's been forever you and Vicky I mean I haven't seen you guys on my lives since the beginning you guys are my OGs my originals of mommy boutique so it's glad I'm glad to have you back can you believe this Rhonda check this out next month in June mommy boutique See, can't talk. Mommy Boutique is two years old next month. Can you believe that? Two years I've been doing this, Rhonda. Crazy. And you were there from the very beginning supporting me when I first started out. So thank you for that. You're a big part of the reason why I'm still here, right? Because if nobody supported me when I started, then I wouldn't be here anymore. So thank you so much, Rhonda, for all your love and support um, from the very beginning. Love you dearly. Um, once this whole pandemic lifts, I actually, I know I talked about this before, but we are planning a trip to go see you uh, over there in Tennessee. Um, so hopefully once this whole thing is lifted, we going to come crash and you may have to kick us out before we leave. No, I'm just kidding. But no, for real though, we, we do want to plan a vacation. I've already planned it. I've already said it because I was supposed to do it last year and you know, life happens and I'm like, no, it's happening. I don't want to keep putting it off because life is short and things like this happen. And I think that seeing family should be priority, right? So we are making it a priority this year. We're going to buy uh, theme park tickets like we always do. No, we are taking a vacation to see you guys. So that is on um, our to-do list this year, Rhonda. So please know that we will be coming to visit you. 
Uh, probably not during the summer like we had hoped because of what's going on, but definitely sometime, maybe even in the winter, maybe we'll spend Christmas with you. I don't know. We'll see <laughs> if that's not too much to ask. We'll have to figure it out. We do plan on going up north for Christmas, though, because I've never seen snow and I would love to see snow. So maybe just maybe if you're up for it, maybe we can come spend Christmas with you guys. Both my mom and Johnny's mom is gone now. And um, they used to be, you know, the event of Christmas. So now that they're gone, Christmas is kind of hard, honestly. So we try to, um, you know, do different things during Christmas. Oh, I love you. Thank you. All right, guys, let's go see if we have any other orders. And if not, um, well, it's, it's not even 11 o'clock yet. So let's hang out a little bit, see if anybody wants to order. Um, usually our raffle will st uh, go at 11, uh, but in, in about 10 minutes, if nobody's ordered, we'll go ahead and do our raffle, but I want to make sure everybody gets a chance to come in and order. Hey, Shannon, welcome. I haven't seen you in forever. Oh yeah. Would Christmas be okay with you guys? Cause I don't want to like crash, you know, you, you have a big family, so I would hate to be like, Hey, we're just coming, you know? And if we do come for Christmas, you got to let me know all the kids and stuff. Cause of course we'll have to come and bring presents, right? You can't go to Christmas without bringing presents. So um, we'll talk about it later. Rhonda, can I call you? Maybe um, I have a, so I have this eight hour again on Saturday, the summit that I'm going to, I don't know what it's called summit event webinar. I don't know, but it's a coaching summit where I'm learning how to launch my coaching business. It's, it's through the school that I'm going to and uh, that I'm, I graduated from, um, which I think is brilliant that they're doing that right now because of this pandemic. And they really want to set all the coaches up for success. And I just think it's amazing that they are allowing us to do this. Um, you know, of course, with all of these things, they're trying to get you to buy something at the end. But either way, like I'm getting so many great nuggets out of it that I don't even care. Like I'm, I'm just there for the information and the learning. So, um, so yeah, the next two days, I'm going to be completely caught up in that as was happening today. That's why my brain is not working. That's why I'm not talking right. Because literally been in front of the camera and uh, talking to the screen for the past, you know, eight hours. So, <laughs> but maybe I'll call you before the summit tomorrow. Cause it doesn't start until later. Um, if you're available, Rhonda, or I'll talk to you on Facebook or something, but I definitely want to pick your brain. Cause I think that that's something we want to do. Okay. So mwah, thank you for that order. Trying to get things settled here. What's going on over there, Trish? You haven't talked to me a lot. Let me know what's going on with you, Miss Trish. My hair is like going crazy. What's going on over here? There we go. There's this one, my camera, the, the camera's backwards, guys. So, if you, <laughs> so it looks on the camera, it looks like it's over here. See? But it's actually on the opposite side. So when I went to grab it on the side that I see it on the camera, it's not the right side. It's, it's a mirror. It's flipped. Yeah, I'll call you tomorrow, Rhonda. Okay? Love you. <laughs> Yeah, what's going on with you, Miss Trish? Tell me. So funny. I look like I have a little like stash of like fattening stuff over here. So don't worry. I didn't eat all these. My kids did. But for the summit, I have a stash of like snacks because, you know, I'm sitting here for so long, like for eight hours. I mean, we do get breaks. So don't get me wrong. Like you get 10 minute breaks. And then, of course, we get a lunch break. But, you know, while you're sitting there. So I have like all of this food, all the snack food that's like sitting around me and I'm just staring at it like, oh my God, everything looks so good. So good. I'm not hungry, but it's just funny. I got cookies. They actually sent me these in the mail, by the way, some of these cookies and stuff for the summit, which was quite cool. Been helping out on the night shift and I'm not 21 anymore. Oh yeah. Wait. So the night shift of what? Did you get a new job? See, I I haven't been in the loop. I didn't know. The last time I talked to you, you were thinking about doing um, secretary work online or something like that. So did you go back to your job? Tell me. I haven't I haven't heard. I have not heard. Do you guys ever have a song that like just never gets out of your head? Like whenever you don't have anything to say, this one song comes in your head. I'll tell you which one mine is. And it's so weird. It's from Moulin Rouge, 
Well, actually, it's from Elton John, but the one that hum I hum in my head is from Moulin Rouge. And it goes, um, how wonderful life is. Now you're in the world. I sat on the roof and I kicked off the moss. Some of these words, well, they got me quite cross. The sun's been kind. When I wrote this song, it's for people like you that keep it turned on. That song, always in my head. And I don't even know why. Always in my head. <laughs> but excuse me. Fucking... I'm still out of work and can't do anything else yet because I'm in the workers' comms. Oh, so that link you sent me requires me to advertise, but I could lose my... Oh, gotcha. So what are you doing for night shift then? Gotcha. Well, I mean, at least you have work on this comp though. That's really good. Some, some people don't even have that right now. So that's good to know. All right, guys, five more minutes, and then if we don't get an order, we will be doing our raffle a little bit earlier than normal. Usually, we wait until 11, but um, since there is no orders going in right now, we will do it in about five minutes, so um, about 10, well, about 10, 40, 45, maybe. Oh, Trish, that is, oh my goodness. Yeah, I remember when Johnny was on um, unemployment. Now that's not the same as workman comp, obviously. But um, but it was the same kind of like, um, he got even less than that. I think he got like 30% of what he made. And so it was really hard for us at first because that's, that's actually what sent us here to where we live now, which ended up being a blessing in disguise. Sometimes those really, really terrible things that happen to you end up being a really awesome blessing. But um excuse me, he, he was making pretty good money. And I was pregnant with, with, uh, Sasha. I was pregnant with Sasha at the time and he lost his job at Gatorland. Um, he had been there for like six years and it was during the time when everybody was just cutting back hours and he was the highest paid entertainer there. So it made sense for them to let him go. Like it just kind of made sense. Plus, um, he was the oldest entertainer there and he was having some back problems and they were afraid about him getting workman's comp, you know? So, um, yeah, he got let go. Um, and we didn't, we were like, we couldn't afford the apartment that we were renting. Cause again, we were like in the heart of Kissimmee area and that's pretty expensive. Um, actually there was some studies guys. I know a lot of you guys aren't from Florida, but there were some studies done on Orlando and how expensive it was. So Orlando is just as expensive as Miami. Now Miami is like a big city. Orlando is a little bit smaller. And the pay in Orlando was three times lower than the amount of rent that you had to pay. So you literally have to work like three jobs to live in Orlando and Kissimmee area. Crazy, right? So anyway, long story short, we ended up having to come to the area that we're in now, um, which is like maybe an hour away from Orlando because we couldn't afford to stay there when he was on um unemployment. But that whole thing um, ended up being a blessing because now we own our house and we have, you know, great friends and family and, and um, well, fa friends that are around us. Most of our family are gone now. Um, Johnny's family is still here. But um, most of my family live up north, <laughs> like uh, Rhonda, all the family that I had from down here. I think I only have like a handful left. Everyone else is all up north now. Um, but anyway, we ended up moving here and it was a wonderful blessing because this is the only place we could afford, not here, but in this area. So ended up being a blessing. Yeah, Pro you're probably right. I mean, he was making pretty good money when he was working over there. So anyway, what's uh, Paige up to and that little Duncan? Sandy, did you leave, darling? Or are you going to stick around for the raffle? Trying to see if I can read the comments on Facebook. I don't know why I can never read the comments on Facebook on my on my.
computer. I always have to go to my phone. It's the weirdest thing. All right. Well, hopefully you'll stick around to see who wins. All right, then I will go ahead and do the raffle a little early because Miss Paige is going to go to bed and I don't want her to miss it. <laughs> so again, if you guys are watching this on the replay or if you're just popping on, we are raffling off this beautiful cutie crab ring. This was designed by me um, with a jeweler. So this is an exclusive design, meaning you're not going to find this anywhere else, at least not this exact design. And inside of the band, we'll say Mommy Boutique because it's exclusively made from my company. Um, so really, really awesome. And the way you guys enter, in case you're watching this for next time, Duncan is sleeping and Paige went to lay down. Okay. Um, the way you get into this raffle, I was here, was in the bathroom. Oh, okay. Well, thanks for sharing. <laughs> Hope you got a good seat there, Sandy. Um $25 gets you in a raffle ticket to win. Do you guys want me to see if uh, Johnny will come be the claw? He's so good at it. Or would you rather me do it? I usually call Johnny in so that he can be the claw. And we do. Let me see if he's available. That way it's fair, right? Because, so you know, he just sticks his hand in there. Let me see if he will come. I don't know. He might be busy. If he's busy, then... Um, the heck oh i'm typing in johnny but my it's under my husband i'm like why can't i not find him because it's under my husband all right i don't know if he's gonna come or not but i texted him oh little duncan is sleeping he's the cutest Little uh, Dominic graduated from pre-K officially today. He got his um, graduation pictures done last week. But today he officially graduated. It was a, it was a drive through graduation. So we got out of the car. Uh, you know, everybody was in their car. And when it was our turn, um, they, they held his picture up on like a banner. Really cute, by the way. Um, they held his picture up on a banner. And um, then we got out and we took his picture with his teachers. I think I posted it up on Facebook. So if you guys are following me on Facebook, you can see him. He's so cute, you guys. Like, seriously, so cute. He was so adorable. He cried when we got home. He missed his teachers so bad. He loves school. Like, seriously, he loves school. And um, for like a whole week straight, he kept saying, um, Miss Barbara, Miss Barbara, because that's the teacher's name. And, and we were like, no, you can't go because remember this whole pandemic. And then we're like, oh, he can't go to school, baby. And I mean, for weeks he was calling for them. So he was so sad when he saw him today for the for the like first time in forever. Oh my god. All right, let's see if Johnny's going to uh, come in or not. I don't know if he will. I hear him coming in. What are you doing? I can't turn the lights off. They can't see who wins. Ah! Oh no, no, no! I don't like the face. Ah, I don't like it. Give me a kiss. Give me a kiss. I get really freaked out, guys. Give me a kiss. Mm. That's close enough. So turn the light on and be the hand, please. Your hand. Oh, my God. I'm making videos. I'm working. Oh, my heart is, like, in my chest right now. And you would think I would be used to that face because okay, I freaking see it everywhere. Up close to me. Up close to me. Move your chair back. I don't have room to stand back here. Move. No, just this side. Because it was like this. Oh. Um. Oh my God. My, my heart is literally guys. He leaves this mask around everywhere and you would think that I would be used to it by this point, but I still get scared. Actually, the other night I walked out from the pearl party and it was dark in the room and he's over there doing a video and I literally screamed just like that. And it's alive too. Oh my gosh. What? And it's alive. We just found out today. <laughs> they don't know what that means. I can show them. All right. What's the prize for the raffle? The, yeah, it's this, it's this cute little crab ring. It's a size seven. Hold on. Let me show them. You don't need to keep your mask on. They can't see you anymore. I gotta go to videos. All right. All right, guys. Here we go. Ready? Oh, that was fast. He like literally didn't even shake it. Sandy! Sandy, you are the winner. Woo! You won last time too. Congratulations. 
Sandy. Are we doing this one? Yeah, just the one. Man, you were like super fast. Well, you shook it. I just grabbed it. I, well, yeah, I one, shook it. First one to touch my hand. Literally, like the first one that touches his hand. Usually, yeah. usually he shuffles. Sandy, congratulations, my love. You are the winner of tonight's ruffle. Sorry for screaming. So sorry, guys. He scares me. Like, seriously, I don't I don't like horror movie stuff. I am not like the horror genre type thing. I don't like it. Oh, well, now I can't get out. He pushed the seat. He pushed the thing so so close I can't get out. Good night, everyone. Needs to get some sleep. Oh, thank you, Trish, for being here. Thank you, uh, Paige, for being here. Sandy, this is your second time winning. Congratulations. Wow. Now, this is a size seven ring. Um, it's not resizable. So you will have to find a ring that a finger that it will fit. Uh, for me, it fits my ring finger pretty nicely. I mean, I know I can't push it all the way up there because I have my other ring on there, but it fits my ring finger pretty nicely. I have one hand. It's funny. This hand, it fits. This one, it's a little tight. So I don't know why one hand is bigger than the other hand, but I guess that's normal. I don't know. Anyway, guys, congratulations to Miss Sandy for winning our raffle. Second win for her. Wow. She won last week's prize as well. Lucky. Oh, my gosh. It is your size? Oh, Sandy, that's perfect. Oh, my gosh. It's your size. Well, there you go. It was meant for you. It was meant for you. I love that. Well, let's take a picture of it because the last picture I put on there, my camera was all weird. I want to like a good picture of it so you can really see it. And my camera was like weird. The color of it was weird. Here we go. I have glitter all over my fingers. Good night, guys. Thank you so much for being here. Get back to my Facebook so I can see Sandy. Hey, it looks like my comments aren't lagging anymore. Awesome. All right, Miss Sandy, congratulations. There you go. I will probably be mailing those out in the next couple weeks unless you get something drilled. If you want something drilled, it does take an extra couple weeks for that. Oh, you're smiling. Oh, I'm so excited. Yay. I love that. I love that so much. I can't believe Johnny scared me. My heart is still in my throat. You would think by this point that I would know. Good night, Rhonda. Thank you for being here. It's been forever since you've been on the live, and I'm so glad that you were here tonight. Just getting your stuff ready, Sandy. All right, guys. It is official. It is good night for everybody. Thank you for being here. We will be back here, so please be here. And uh, follow me on Instagram, guys, at uh, mommy.boutique, because we will be doing the color of the month. If you want to vote, please vote. Um, also, we can do that on Facebook as well. Facebook page is Mommy Boutiques with an S at the end. Um, so I will see you guys back here on Monday. Good night, everybody. Mwah, mwah, mwah. Congratulations again to Sandy. Good night, Paige. Good night, Trish. Good night, Taylor. Good night, Sandy. Good night, Rhonda. Good night, everybody. <laughs> Good night, John Boy. <laughs> see you next time. <laughs>